Hey there. I remember happiness. Happiness and being healthy largely centers around your state of mind and the work that goes into it to create a positive environment for your existence. To be stuck with yourself for eternity is both terrifying and oddly comforting. <laughs> it is a feeling, a state of mind, an illusion that we all crave and justify in our own minds. I've been distracted. I've been busy. I've been absent. I've been happy. I like me when I'm distracted. It's not healthy. It's not good, but I like me then. I'm so fucking happy. I know that I'm not always happy, and I wish that weren't the case. I think happiness is peaceful, though. I think there is love. More love than I've ever had. I'm aware of the fact that this could very well be my last day on Earth, and I would have no way of knowing it. Feelings are so consuming. Feelings are so consuming. Breathe. It, it feels alive. alive. It's, it's so calm. calm. It's, it's slow, but, but it's still alive. To, to watch, watch others, others die. To anticipate your own death. To be human is a painful privilege. I don't think that we're all meant to be the same or think the same. If you don't have thoughts, is that then a thought to not have thoughts? What's it like not to think? Are we still alive if we're not thinking? Who knows? Not me, but I'll definitely think about it. My thoughts are really confusing. I think I'm really confusing when I talk, and that a lot of people struggle to understand. I think a lot. I think constantly. My thoughts race a lot. I think a lot about everything at once. I have an internal battle with who I think I am versus who people perceive me to be, which honestly hinders my perception of myself sometimes. Who, who am, am I, I today? Why is it so hard to talk? I so desperately want to own every aspect of spontaneity. Those are the times when I feel most alive. That's the root of tenderness, I guess. Being loved when you know that there are pieces of you that should be. I require it. I am aware of the stillness of this moment. Words have the ability to really mean things, but the absence of them can also be so impactful. I think that it's really how you get people to listen, to be quiet. I reflect on my awareness in the present moment and in my life as it was and will be as I continue my journey of existence. I am aware of my conscious mind thinking all of these thoughts as I sit on the concrete on a spring day. I am aware of my breathing and how it just occurs while I think without a hitch. Give yourself room to breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Repeat.